Well, how do there, chums? I'm loading into No Man's Sky, and I'm on my wintry planet. I figured I'd do a few little tours. This is over on my PlayStation save, so we'll see what bases are there. And yeah, this is this is not my normal legacy save. Yeah, I've had to revert to this one. But anyway, let's fly on out and let's take a quick look at a couple of bases, shall we? Hey, guess let's jump on over. Okay, chum, so I'm on my No Man's Sky. Winter is here. Planet, now if you do want to come here and build, there's the actual code on the screen there, so you can come and hit this up if you want to build here. I am hoping to put videos live every Monday. Now, this base was by John Ninja Dojo Boy. And, uh, yeah, Merry Christmas. Look at this snowman, isn't he cute? It's freaking gorgeous, I guess. Isn't And look at all these presents under the Christmas tree. Ha ha ha! Freaking littered with prezzies. Nice one, John. So yeah, there's John Ninja Dojo's name on the screen right there. Got a load of floating cubes as well. Another snowman here on skis. With the actual poles in his hands. Oh, I love the face on that. That's so cool. Nicely done. And uh, heading down a little bit. Further. There's another snowman here with flags in his hand. Really cool. I guess it looks like a jolly Santa. Oh, a jolly snowman, that one. So there's quite a few snowmen. There's like three or four snowmen. There's another one there right by the portal. Merry Christmas indeed, John. So, yeah, I showed this one off on our weekend mission jaunt. Yes, John was actually with us and he showed us around. But up here, look at this. This is, this is awesome. Let's go into camera mode for this. And you can see here we've got a Santa sleigh. And you can actually sit in the driver's seat on that. We're complete with reindeers. Heck yeah. Awesome idea, that. Reindeer's idea. Brilliant, eh? Very nice build, this, John. Very impressed with what you've managed to put together here, my friend. So, yeah, we came here after the weekend mission on Friday, but I thought I'd put this into my base tools video. And I, I really, really like this one. You know what? Let's, uh, let's get a little thumbnail image of this, I think. So let's, uh, let's try and get something going with this one. Heck yeah. And... Um, you know, I don't know whether to, because that's quite a long thing to get in the thumbnail. I think it might be easier just to go with one of my favourite snowmen amongst all of these guys down here. I think this one's quite cool with the ship there. I think that will make a good thumbnail. So if I get it a bit closer to me, like so, like that, I'm just go. There we go. That'd do for a thumbnail, wouldn't it? Okay, well, that's pretty darn freaking wicked. Love that. Really, really cool base. Now, we did visit one other base. Let's see if it's still in my recent history. And we'll go do a quick tour of that. Ah, no, it just says bases. Aha, there it is, there it is. Dad Dog. So we went to Dad Dog's um, base. So if you are to build here, if you don't want me to visit your base, if it's not ready for a showcase, then please put WIP for work in progress inside of the title. OK, and if you do want me to visit, make sure it hasn't got WIP in the title and I will feature it. Cool. This is the bike beat at the base. That is actually playing in the background. Freaking awesome. I've just turned the music up. I'll have to turn it back down again now. OK, let's have a look at this base then. Lovely jubbly. So this is by Dad Dog 7689 And then we've got like a little toy chest here. Bits and bobs in. That's pretty darn cool, even on its own. We've got like a little teleporter. Hasn't got any power right now. Let's uh, toggle the power flow. There we go. Power flow is on. So I can use that teleporter if I really wanted to. We've got a chair here. We've got other bits and bobs going on. A little shrunken save beacon. You know what, I'd, I'd hit the save so I'm actually on this planet. We've got like a um, multi-tool rack. Freaking awesome. Some cabinets. Here's the bike beat that you can hear. Sofa complete with pillows. Little coffee table. Freaking awesome. So there is some glitch building that's taken place here to shrink some of these objects. Done an outstanding job. It's, it looks freaking dapper, doesn't it? Got all these shelves over here. Some ladders. Oh, look, it goes up to the roof area. Very nice. Some little presses up there as well. Christmas tree. Yeah, very cool with presents underneath. Very nice indeed. Very nice. Very cosy. Awesome. I mean, look at this kitchen. Freaking great, isn't it? Nutrient processor there, little bubble tube. It's like one of the old soda streams from the 80s. Freaking epic! I guess. I love the wash, wash basin. Wonders projector over here as well. 
What is actually projecting though? I don't I don't see what it's projecting. But there we go. Cool, yeah. Very awesome. Well, uh, let's have a quick look see outside. There's some artwork out there. Looks like wrapping paper, doesn't it? Another little Christmas tree as well. Let's head on out. Very cool. Very nicely done, this base. Really impressive stuff. Very cosy, a very nice, a nice little nook, a nice little lodge. Yeah, you've done a fantastic job there. Heck yeah! Anyway, let's hit on up the teleporter. Where was it? I turned it on earlier, didn't I? There it is! It's a teeny tiny. Okay, let's see if there's any other bases that we can look at here. So if I go to other bases, we should see more. Okay, so we've got Merry Christmas by Old Beard. Now, they haven't got WIP in the title. So I'm assuming it's okay to go there. Let's go and have a look at that one then. Thank you. Yes. Warp to Merry Christmas. Right, so we have arrived at Merry Christmas. Who made this base? Old Beard. Okay, let's head on out then. Let's have a look at Old Beard's base. Sweet. We've got a little teleporter lodging there. We've got lots of Christmas trees around. This is like a Christmas tree farm. Me and Ivy went to a Christmas tree farm, which was pretty darn nice. Have real reindeers. It's a vlog video. I'll put a link up there if I can find it. Very cool. Nice little cosy sofa in front of a fire. Nice little rug. Oh, it was almost just like wrapping paper, that. Very gnarly. I doubt back out here. Let's have a look over at the opposite side of here before we head forwards. It looks like a power room. Yeah. With lots of light bulbs. Very nice. Massive Christmas trees. And uh, what's over this way then? Liking the hovering lights. Very festive. Very nice. The peel lights. Nice. We've got some flaming barrels out here just to keep ourselves a little bit toasty and warm. Oh, you could fish from here, couldn't you? That'd be nice. Little fishing nook in a roundabout way. Oh, look at that thing. Very cool. Very Christmassy. Okay, where's this teleporter take us then? Let's have a give it a go. Zoom! Ooh, where am I? Okay. Bazaar. Oh, huzzah. We've got like an underwater area as well. Well, this would be good for fishing too, wouldn't it? You know? Ah, it is for fishing. Look, we've got some um, little fish keeping things over here. Automated traps. Oh, it hasn't automated anything for me. But lovely jubbly. Nice little fishing... Christmas, Merry Christmas fishing base, this one. Very awesome. Very awesome indeed, people. So, yeah, if you do need to catch your frost biome fish and you're on this planet, this would be a good place to do it, I think. Very nice base, I guess. Let's head on back on over to the old teleporter and see what other bases we have. But before we do that, let's just pop into camera mode. Boom. Let's have a look at this from the sky. and just make sure that there isn't anything that I didn't comb over or miss. I'm liking it. It is like a little Christmas nook, isn't it? With these Christmas trees surrounding it. What a perfectly round island. What a lovely find. Yeah, very cool. All right, anyways, let's head on over here then. Let's see what next base we can look at. So here we go. Other bases. So we've done these three. We've got Game Cat Cowboy Dan. And it's a Christmas arcade. Christmas arcade. Let's head on over to the Christmas arcade. Okay. I can hear bite beats yet again. Oh, wow. We've got an appearance modifier as soon as we arrive. We've got this little chap here, which looks like he's been put there by the hollow projector. Isn't he weird colours? Looks like he's made out of candy floss and marshmallow. We've got a little ladder up there. Can we climb this ladder? Oh, yeah, we can. Where's that taking us? Oh, look, it's a little bed nook. Ha ha. That's so cool. We've got a heating unit here. Keep us warm in these chilly nights. Yeah, why not, mate? Freaking heck yeah. Nice. We've got like a weapons terminal here. And the owner of the base would actually see a vendor there. So that's cool. Got a little table here. I'll tell you what, though. Your um, bite beats are like my bite beats. Completely out of tune. We've got this. Let's hit that up. Oh, dear. That's the appearance modifier. I wanted to hit this up. Boom. Because these make pretty patterns. Look at that. Isn't that sweet? That's Christmassy on its own. We've got previous base cache over there. We've got some barrels that we can harvest for goodies. Nice. We've got some plants going on here. A Christmas tree laden. Laden with prezzies. All with decals on and everything. 
freaking awesome you've actually spent some time doing your presents under your tree i just stuck a load of boxes under mine but you've actually gone to town and put decals on them like wrapping paper very nicely done you got these guys again they kind of look like i don't know they almost look geck like but they're not are they they're, they're like the creatures from a planet ah and here's the arcade so you've got like a racing simulator there by the looks of things and another one you got this guy actually on the racing simulator cool you go for it mate we've got these ones over here playing these little arcade machines heck yes four button joystick games lovely jubbly heck yeah that one looks like it's a space racing game with the normandy very nice okay cool yeah not too oh, this almost looks like it's a street fighter -y one the atlantid versus the atlas go for it buddy yeah awesome i mean you have to use a bit of imagination don't you but freaking great i love it i love your christmasy arcade it's very awesome you got some harvesters here oh look at those look at those like uh hollow projectors they're awesome aren't they you got the actual robot -y type guys all the way around here maybe that's security or something i love it i like the actual ceiling oh look at this he's got a santa sleigh as well i say he sorry to assume your gender but i mean yeah with, with a name like yours though I mean, what was it again let's just remind ourselves who made this gamer cat cowboy dan yeah okay here we go so there we are lovely jubbly santa sleigh but with robots that's going to be a bit reliable isn't it you don't have to feed those ones carrots do you heck no freaking awesome mate very cool very cool base very impressive really like it that's that's epic nice one cowboy dan right was there a teleporter did i arrive for a teleporter i did so we can head back on over to the teleporter i think uh let me in let me in okay can't use that door all right fine i'm going through this one there we are let's head on over this way sweet that almost looks like a giant santa hat on the top of there that tube very nicely done in red and white Hold on, there's a teleporter here. I didn't I didn't use the teleporter, did I? Boom. Oh, okay, cool. We've got like a little dance room down here as well, a disco. I nearly missed this. There's a whole freaking bar down here. Disco, disco, disco. Heck yes. We could have a little dance, couldn't we? We could have a little dance. Why the fudge not, mate? Yeah. Haha. -ha. There we go. Can I go into camera mode without pausing? Yes, I can. There we go. That looks freaking great. We've got more arcade machines down here as well. And there's the bite beat. I wondered where the bite beat was. It's kind of hidden underneath, isn't it? And we've got more arcade machines over here. Freaking groovy. Heck yeah. This is really, really cool. Oops, I slammed into something I shouldn't have. Whoops, and now I've gone over here. Awesome. It's quite tightly compact. You've got to be really, really slow on the old hatch stands, as I call them, the thumb sticks. Very nice hello guys there's me dancing over there freaking awesome bartender yeah you really have gone to town on this the attention to detail is something else nice one and there's another teleporter here i wonder if i've missed something else okay it's just another bar yeah it's got different bartenders and there's like a you know, it's some sort of jackpot machine there holy fudge i nearly missed all of this this is insane this is so cool how many floors are there oh look at this one that's very that's unusual isn't it can i actually sit on this oh my days that's so clever so it looks like i'm sitting on that bar stool from a miniature chair i like how you did that that is so sneaky and we got ourselves a load of other presents under that tree and another teleporter around here oh my days and there's a dance floor even on the roof holy mackerel loads more loads more to see and do inside of here and i nearly missed all of this this looks like a karaoke machine come disco machine and dance floor freaking epic well that's an impressive base that's a very impressive base i mean i had no idea it was so large look at it it's all over the all over this let's head back into here then where the teleporter was how do i get back in lovely awesome i hopefully i've seen it all but you know you can always come by here and take a look yourselves people so here we go other bases that is so awesome very cool dread's christmas cottage and this is just by dread let's go there i don't know whether it's adventures with dread it just says dread but we'll go there we'll go over to the christmas cottage 
Boom! Well, I've arrived in what appears to be some sort of greenhouse. Yeah, with a tiny, tiny teleporter on the table. Let's head on through then. Okay, we've got ourselves a little save point. Those are some nice views. Oh, I say nice views. There's a freaking dog out there. Freaking evil looking thing. There's the base computer right there. Lovely jubbly. Let's remind ourselves whose base this is. This is Dread. Coolio. And we've got like a little jellyfish. We've got a Christmas tree by an open fire. This is very nice. I like your lampshade. That's very cool. Very nice. Decals on the wall. Let's head on through here. Another fireplace. Thank you. Yes. Lovely bed. Awesome. Very cosy. It's got a very cosy feel to it, this. Right, is this a door? Can I head on outside? Let's have a look out here quickly. Let's go in the old camera mode. Let's have a quick look see at this base. And from the sky. Got a lot of solar panels out here. Quite a lovely little base. Very nice little log cabin. Just nestled up. Up here. Yeah, it's got lots of Christmas lights on this side. Very cool. Did I see this little table in here? I don't know whether I did or didn't. Let's have a quick look through the window. Got some plates on the table. Oh yeah, I don't think I've gone round that way. Looks like a kitchenette or something round there. I have to pop on round. Oh yeah, so there's a little bit more to see inside of here. All right, well, let's head back in then and see if I can find what I missed. Gated. Let's head on through these doors here. Fireplace. Bedroom. Go back this way then. Ah, here we go. We've got ourselves a nice little sort of like mini oven there. That's very nicely put together. There's almost looks like a dishwasher there. And we've got a sink there with some dishes ready to be washed. We've got a cooker there with four rings. Very nice. Microwave, units. Everything you could want from IKEA. Heck yes. And we've got ourselves a lovely table over here. Cool, yeah. Well, I think I've seen everything on this base too now, peeps. Heck yeah. Okay. Um, I guess we could head back in. We could do one more base this episode, I suppose, people, couldn't we? Let's head on over to the old teleporter. Let's have a look what bases we can find. Other base here. So, okay, well, let's uh, let's go here then. This is by Damovo, and it's uh, Zesket Azu. Hmm, okay. Looks like a giant Christmas tree made of chocolate. And we have arrived. I guess we have. Um... All right. Well, this is a bit odd. Um, shouldn't there be a giant Christmas tree right here? There should be, shouldn't there? Maybe they decided to move their base to another location. I have had people tell me, Captain Steve, where you went, the reason you didn't see my base is because I deleted my base computer and moved somebody out somewhere else because somebody built too close to my base. Hmm, maybe this is one of those instances, peeps. Yeah, because there is another base right there, look. Maybe that's what's happened. I don't know. Look at night, says this one over here. Okay. Well, we could take a look over there, I suppose, couldn't we? Because I'm not seeing anything here right now. And look, there's no report base function. I think they've deleted their base. All right. Let's head on over to that base that's in close proximity then. Half a chow. It says to be here at night time. So, you know, that's exactly what time it is. Splosh! It looks like it hasn't all rendered in. And this could be because it's built quite close to another base. Or was near to another base. So that's something to keep in mind, people. You know, if you do build near to somebody else's base, it doesn't just scupper your base. It also scuppers their base or causes loading issues. I mean, look at this. We've got things floating off the ground and all sorts here. So I really don't know what's going on. But it says to visit here at night. I can only assume that it's fully built. We've got some sort of like glitch going on there as well. Let's just stand on the roof of here. Let's go into camera mode and let's have a look at this from the sky because I think that's the way we're supposed to be looking at this. Whoops. Wrong button. I was trying to get the menu off the screen. There you go. And here's these weird snowflakes. Look at those. They're so cool. Oh, nicely done, mate. Oh, they're really, really cool. They're really quite colourful. They're really quite awesome, actually, your snowflakes. Heck yeah. Look at these. Very gnarly. Definitely worth coming here at night to see these guys. There's all sorts just uh, rendering in. There's a lot. Look, there's something trying to render in over here. 
we got something that just appeared there. It was like quite a nice building, actually. Pretty darn freaking epic. Whatever this is, it's quite large. There's a lot going on here. I really like them, like these weird snowflakey things. Almost like UFOs or something. There's a teleporter up there. I imagine I'm supposed to go up to where that teleporter is to get a better view of the whole area. Um, there's a big teleporter there. There's a small teleporter down here. Let's head on into there. We've got this down here as well. Very cool. Popped up with a little message there. I wasn't quick enough to read it. Let's head on through here then. Let's see where this takes us. Boom. Oh, it's like a mid-level, I think, isn't it? Oh, that's so cool. And I guess we've got like a little sitting chamber here. Let's uh, have a little sit. Yeah, this is very cool. Snowflake Lake. Ha ha ha! Snowflake Lake. Very cool. Love it. So this is... Who's this one by? Let's have a look. This is by... It doesn't say the name of the person. Okay, it just says Look at Night, which isn't the name of the person. So I have no idea who's actually put this together. It's not really coming up with a, a name. Very cool base, though. And look at this, down on ground level now. It's all starting to appear. Felicides. Felicides. Is that is that Latin? Who knows? Oh, very cool. You got a little guy there at the bar. Very nice. And this big tower. That big tower has actually got a teleporter on it. I wonder if I can fly up there. I haven't fully upgraded my um, jetpack with this character, so this might go horribly wrong. Yeah, I was going to go horribly wrong. Okay, ah, I managed to stand on the edge of that so at some point, didn't I? Let's try that again. Okay. Aha, we've got like a little resting nook. Okay, let's go again. Ah, go! That'd teach me to eat too many pies, wouldn't it? Okay. I'm in. A little bit higher. Let's wait for the jetpack to recharge all the way. Let's go again. Oh yeah, go 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 go. Are we going to make it all the way to the top? Let's give it a go. No, no, we bounced off. Oh dear. Well, we give up with that idea. But anyway, we saw it from the top anyway with the old teleporter. Very cool base. Very nice indeed. There's probably stuff I haven't seen inside some of these buildings as well. Sweet. Let's have a look inside of here. Oh, Christmas presents. We've got a little fireplace with decals or Christmas cards. Very nice. Little bar here. Looks like a fish tank there. Very awesome. We can head on upstairs. Very nice. We've got a little bedroom up here. Oh, this is great. I really like this. This is very cool, isn't it? Very festive. Good base to end off on, to be fair, isn't it, people? So there we go. Well, let's end off by this Christmas tree, I think. So there you go, people. Isn't that awesome? Well, I've had a great time touring these bases. And like I say, if you do want to come here and uh, take part in this, let's just go back over to the screen for a second so I can put the portal code back up on the screen. And like I say, I'll probably do pre-recorded videos like this from here on in, just in case I encounter any base rendering issues, things like that. I can cut them out and all that sort of shenanigans. I think it's a better format doing it this way. Sound up in the comments, let us know. But if you do want to come here, I am going to try and do this sort of video every Monday. I am away during the festive period. I will try and make it the weekend before I go away and then put it live on the Monday when I was supposed to premiere it at 6 of the PMs. So there you go, people. Salute to Monday. And uh, hopefully you're going to see you over here building and doing all that sort of shenanigans. And if you like this video, hit a like and subscribe. And if you've already done that, share this out with friends that play No Man's Sky or might be interested in picking it up or you want them to pick it up. They might think, oh, God, this is like Minecraft, but a million times better. Yeah, until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Steve Jack